everybody it's uh, bright and early on a Monday morning and since I didn't go to my gastric bypass class last week because of the cold that we had I have to go to a makeup class today uh, and it's nine o'clock in the morning the class so it's about 8 30 right now or 8 20 and we are on our way. Kevin's going to drop me off and then come home and do a few things that uh, need to get done real quick before he picks me back up. And uh, anyway, I uh, don't think it's going to be a good thing when I step on the scale because... With being sick, I wasn't cooking, Kevin wasn't cooking, so I was eating poorly, and uh, I think when I step on the scale, it's not going to look very good, but, oh well, that is what it is, you know? Morning. Good morning, baby. I don't feel good. So, same symptoms? No, it's, both my ears are clogged, I can barely hear. Um, my back hurts quite a bit, which was kind of knows my from coughing. I didn't think I coughed a lot yesterday, but boy, does my back hurt, my lungs hurt. I can't go this way, by the way. Yeah. Other than my shoulder being very sore, I'm actually feeling pretty good. And my shoulder's sore for a few reasons. Not because I took it off to show you guys my purple ribbon last night. And because I made the heart by myself. Because I didn't move my shoulder to do those things. I moved my lower part of my arm. And when I did lift my arm to show you the ribbon, I used my other arm to lift it. Right, dear? Yes, dear. Somebody complained? I don't know. I haven't looked at any messages. Okay. But you, you complained. I do. You, you do all kinds of crazy stuff. So, hello, everybody. I just finished up my class. And I really, really do like the morning classes. Um, much better. The instructor is much nicer. The people in the class are much nicer. They, um just it's a smaller class there's not as many people it's just it's just a really different environment altogether and I'm much happier in this class I feel like I'm learning stuff in this class so I spoke with the instructor today and she's going to call one of the case managers and see if there's anything she can do <coughs> to get me switched over. And all my great plans of going home and doing all this cleaning, um, not gonna happen because I didn't sleep at all last night and I was actually falling asleep in class for a little bit there towards the end. So, I'm kind of tired. She's up all night long. Yeah, I didn't sleep at all. So, and I went to the pharmacy because I've run out of my prescription. And uh, I checked at um, Kaiser and there was actually a, a refill on my prescription. So, I thought, oh, so I'm, I'm sure I can get it here, but I'd have to pay a uh, full for the amount. Prescription. So, and I figured. It can't be that much. It's a medication that's been around for a very long time. So I went in and um, it was uh, $300. So needless to say, I didn't. I left without my medication. And um, gonna tr they gave me information on taking it to Walmart, see if I can get it cheaper there. But uh, it just kind of t really drives it home that I have to figure out something for... Uh, Insurance. Insurance. 
But right now... And I'm feeling better, by the way. I'm not so grumpy as I was this morning, so... I feel a little better. I can actually hear. Glad you're not so grumpy. So, it's really tough when you can't hear. And when you talk, all you hear is the noise in your head. It's just loud. But you can't hear anybody else, so I'm talking like... I don't want to hear myself. It's painful. <laughs> hey, baby. Hey, sweetie. So, we just stopped off at the post office to drop off a couple of items that we're mailing out. Or is it a secret? Yes, it's a secret. There's a secret package coming to somebody. And we uh, checked our post box and we got a card from Angie Lupus Life. So, I'll have to open that up when we get home. Right now we're going to go to uh, uh, Jack in a Box and I'm going to have my greasy tacos and what are you going to have? I don't know if I'm, well, I don't know yet. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to have a breakfast or if I'm going to go with a burger. Some, some sort of burger. Some sort of burger. Some sort of burger. Okay. So, I shouldn't eat it, but I'm going to because I'm hungry. <laughs> so how's your greasy tacos? Nice and greasy. Just like you like them. How's your whatever that is? Very good. Very yep. good. So we're watching, what is this, episode five already? Yeah. Episode 5 of Game of Thrones. And then since I didn't sleep at all last night, Kevin's going to put me to bed. And hopefully I can fall asleep. Hi. What are you doing? What are you doing over there? Okay. Oh. You want the camera? <coughs> you want to hold the camera? You can do it! Yay! You did it, Boomer! You did it, Boomer! Hi! Boomer! Hi, Boomer! Hi, Boomer. Yo, Boom. Boommeister. Oh. Boomer. Yo, don't ignore me. I'm talking to you. Don't ignore me. He's like, Dad, she disturbed my sleep. You did, didn't you? I was just all happy. All right, so I ended up having to put Val to bed. She has a gastroparesis attack, and the medication that she takes for that just knocks her out. So what I've been doing while she's been asleep is mostly... Uh, Laundry, right Freckles? Boring the dog, boring the cat, watching some tube. Cleaning up a little bit today's trash day so I had to put the trash out. So my garage is a mess again. Uh, again, unloading stuff, trying to get rid of stuff. So I do believe I... Uh, I don't have a wash. I do have one in the dryer. Which I should probably pull out so it doesn't get wrinkled. Not that I care, but... Some of it's valves. And uh, so I'm going to try and do shout-outs tonight by myself. Because uh, Val's just not going to be able to do them at all. So... 
I am what you get. I see you. I see you. What you doing, buddy? Huh? What you doing? What you doing? So that's all we have for today's vlog. I had to put Val to bed. She uh, got one of her gastroparesis attacks and the medication she takes puts her out. So see you all tomorrow. Hope you liked the vlog. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe, share this video, and we will see you tomorrow.